Hey there Pisces, this is Renee and welcome back. Pisces, this is going to be your next three months, what you can expect, what's coming forward, what is going on in the next three months for you, okay? Um, if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. And if it doesn't resonate, take a look at your other placements, okay? So make sure to stay tuned to the end when I pull your angel number. We'll take a look at the meaning, okay? So let's get into this, Pisces. What is going on for Pisces the next three months? What can Pisces expect in the next three months? What's going on? Okay, we have celebration. Wow, okay. This is a wonderful time in your life. Difficulties fall away and the light at the end of the tunnel is a star you can wish upon. The timing is right to make long-term plans for a joyful future. Have faith that things are going to turn out beautifully. Okay, so there may be celebration in the next three months. There may be something that you're celebrating, some kind of party, some kind of get-together, some kind of success that you are celebrating. Let's go ahead and get some more energy for Pisces. More energy for Pisces, please. Okay, we have exercise to increase your energy and manifestation abilities. The key to manifesting quickly is to have very high energy levels. And the easiest way to increase them is through physical exercise. Choose a fun and meaningful activity so that you look forward to exercising and it becomes your own reward. So I feel like you're manifesting something and Spirit is letting you know, okay, this is how you manifest something more quickly into your life. Some, some kind of success that you'll be achieving. Um... I feel like something is coming forward that's going to bring you a lot of success. Let's go ahead and move these over for you. Okay, let's get some more energy for Pisces. Let's get some more energy for Pisces. Okay, we have patience. I accept that everything happens in its design in its divine order. So I feel like you're you're waiting for something. You're waiting for something to come through. You're waiting for things to happen for some kind of situation to unfold. Okay? And um, I feel like you've been patiently waiting for something to happen. But I feel like it's very close. It's coming forward for you now. Okay, so let's get some more energy. We'll get one more card. Okay, we have confusion. Okay, so I feel like, you know, there may be some things that are not clear. Some things that you really don't know the answers of at the moment. So I feel like there's some kind of confusion that's blocking you. Some kind of confusion that may be around you. This may be your energy or this may be someone close to you. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the tarot. First off, what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at what you are releasing in order to bring in something better, to put yourself in a better position, to um, release something for your greater good. Okay, so let's see what is Pisces releasing during this three months? What is being released during this three month period? Spirit, give me a message. What's Pisces releasing, please? Okay, we have the Five of Wands. Wow. Strength. And the Nine of Pentacles. Okay, at the bottom we have the Seven of, of Wands. So I feel like what you're releasing, Pisces, is you're releasing the need to control every situation of your life. I feel like there are things that you're going to stand up for. There are things that, you know, you are going to defend and, you know, stand on, stand your ground at certain points. But I feel like, you know, you are going to be releasing the need to have full control over your situation and to surrender 
to the divine because I feel like there's something that you're waiting for. There's something that you really don't have any power over. So I feel like, you know, you're just sitting back waiting for this to happen. So you really don't have control of the situation. You're just waiting. Okay. And I feel like, you know, there's, there's some kind of energy here to where you may need to take the lead on a certain situation but i feel like spirit is letting you know that you're you know what you're waiting for is coming through you're going to reap your harvest here um but you need to be strong you need to have faith and be confident in your actions because what you are what you're trying to achieve is going to come into fruition you are manifesting this this independence this abundance that you're looking for okay there's there's going to be a reason for celebration and i feel like it's because you worked very hard in your situation okay we'll go ahead and take a look at what challenges pisces will be facing in the next three months what what challenges is pisces facing in the next three months what obstacles and challenges please the devil, negative intentions, negative people, being able to be triggered and taking the action that you need to take. Wow. Okay. Okay. We also have the eight of pentacles at the bottom. So I feel like a challenge for you is to um, wait on something that is coming forward. Okay, and then again, we see that, you know, he's waiting for this pinnacle to be finished. You know, it's something that he worked very hard on. He's worked very hard on these pinnacles. And now he's waiting for that last one to be finished. You know, he's working on the last one. He has his hammer and his mallet to go ahead and carve it out. So I feel like, you know, there's something that you're actively waiting on. It's coming. But I feel like your challenge is to stay away from drama. Stay away from the things that you know are going to be very negative in your life. Staying away from something that you are liable to obsess about. Okay? I feel like there's some kind of energy that's around you that may become obsessive at times. There may be some kind of addiction, maybe gambling or maybe alcohol. Um, sometimes it can be, you know, um, promiscuousness, you know. But I feel like there's some negative energy that, you know, you are battling yourself to stay away from, you know. So, and I feel like that's going to be a challenge. That's going to be your challenge to kind of defeat these demons that you have here and to stay your course, remain confident in your actions and, you know, take the inspired actions that you need to take because I feel like that is what is going to promote you and that is what is going to be gifted to you in the end and i feel like by taking these inspired actions you're not going to miss your opportunity to you know rise above to you know gain this abundance or whatever this success is that you're looking for okay so we're going to take a little bit more information on what this challenge is. I want a little bit more information on this challenge. Okay. But I feel like you're standing up for something. I feel like there's something that you're fighting for. You know. Um, maybe it's you're fighting against yourself. Or maybe this is, you know, fighting to keep a dream alive. You know. Maybe you're standing your ground on some sort of decision that you're making. And now you need to just take action. Okay. So let's go ahead and get some clarity for this. Okay. Yeah. We have the six of pentacles. Okay. So someone's going to offer you a gift. Someone's going to offer you some kind of generosity. Some kind of value. I feel like this is also maybe someone sharing with you a valuable lesson that they've learned um 
But I feel like there's opportunities that are available for you. Now you need to choose the cup that you want to take this opportunity on. See here, I feel like you're pouring out this offer because it just doesn't work. But I feel like there is an offer on the table that will bring a huge opportunity, that will bring a nice abundant windfall for you, okay? But the, the thing is to find balance in your situation, um, some kind of equal give and take, some kind of equal pull that needs to happen, okay? So let's take a look at what's coming in for Pisces. Uh, what blessings will be coming in for Pisces during this three-month period? What blessings are coming in? Okay, something is done and over with. Let's see. Okay, the Two of Wands. The waiting is over. Okay, laying your burdens down. And moving into a new opportunity, a new direction. Okay. Yeah, we definitely have celebration, get together, some kind of reunion happening here. So there is going to be some kind of celebration. There is going to be reason to celebrate. Um, this could also be someone coming back, someone that you've worked with before, someone that you collaborated with. I feel like they're going to offer you some kind of help. Okay, so let's take a look at this for Pisces. So I feel like your waiting is over. I feel like you've been waiting for a very long time. The wait is over. This is done with. You know, um, the two of wands, some, you're waiting for something to happen. That You know, this is now over. Okay, so something is truly happening. And I feel like... You know, your plans are now finally unfolding. Um, you're able to make more plans and really look towards the future. Really, um, really evolve something that you were working on. When I'm looking at this card, I really feel like this is holding the world in your hands like you feel like you're on top of the world okay um i'm also getting you and me against the world so this may be someone coming in that's offering you help but i feel like this is something that's going to make you very happy very blessed you know i feel like your cup is running over with gratitude and love because you're able to lay down your burdens. You're able to let go of a lot of worry and anxiety that may have been blocking you at one time. And you're now able to set your priorities to where you're able to focus on the things that are truly important to you. Okay, so this may be a lot of money coming in that's going to help you along the way because you're moving into a bigger and better position. You're moving from calmer waters into this new discovery, okay, into this new beginning. You're taking the lessons that you've learned with you and now you're moving. So you could be literally moving into a new space, a new house, a new apartment, maybe even a new job within the next three months. But I feel like you've, you've now landed and now you're discovering this new land. You're discovering this new place where you've landed. Okay? So, and I feel like there's going to be a lot of changes that are in store for you. And I feel like there is blessings in store. I feel like something is coming true that you've been waiting for for a while. Let's go ahead and get a little bit more clarity for Pisces. Let's get a little bit more clarity, please. What is this? The moon. Something that was once healed is now being revealed. Something that is once you thought was done with is now bringing you prosperity. You had a lot of patience in this situation. You've been waiting for something to happen, and now that is here. That is here. Something is done and over with. 
you have this new beginning, this new love, this new venture. Look at this, the King of King of Cups. This is you. You're sitting on your throne. After this has transpired, you're able to really focus, really put your time and effort into things that you love. But this is definitely something that you've been waiting for, something that was hidden, that you were really waiting for a conclusion. Um, you were waiting for things to happen. And now the sun is starting to shine. You're ready to really put that forward because now the waiting is over. You're, you know, something has ended and something new is beginning. Okay, so this is this is being grateful, supported. You know, you have this happiness and this happy ending here. Okay, so something that you didn't expect had to end so that something new could come through. You know, I'm going to get... Hmm. Let's get one more card. One more card. The hangman. You've taken on a different perspective of the weight that you've been carrying. You're becoming more aware of the things that were burdening you. The things that you were carrying that were too heavy to carry. You're becoming more aware of these things. You're becoming more wiser in your situation. You're no longer confused as to what needs to be done. You have the clarity. You have the know-how. You have the ability. You know? Um, so it's beautiful energy here, Pisces. Okay, let's get a message for Pisces. What's going on with love? Let's get a message for Pisces. What's going on in love? Oh, my stomach. I don't know why as soon as I start filming, my stomach starts growling. You guys make me hungry for some reason. I don't know why that is. Okay, um, let's take a look at Pisces. Okay, we have addiction, and that's just like I was feeling. I feel like this devil is here for a reason. There's something that, you know, there's some kind of codependency. Dependency. There's some kind of obsession, some kind of controlling issue. Um, there's something that's blocking you. Um, there, it may be due to some kind of separation. Uh, but this separation, I feel like someone's missing you. Someone's thinking a lot about you. Maybe this was a codependent relationship. Um, maybe it was kind of negative. But I feel like, you know, um, this person misses you a lot, Pisces. See, let's get some messages. What does this person want to say to Pisces? Okay. We do have a new job here, so there may be a new job in your forecast. I miss you. I need to see you. Okay? So there's definitely someone who misses you here. And we have... Let's see, these cards are sticking together. We have you're being called to have faith in your situation. The outcome will be positive. We also have letting go of the past. Okay? And we have good luck. So something good is happening. Um, but I do feel like there's someone who is missing you a lot. I know that the unknown is scary, but you are ready. Okay? So those are the messages that I have for you. At the bottom, I have karma. So someone may be getting their karma in this situation. Um, someone may be hurt because maybe they hurt you. Okay? But I feel like your, your, your tides are changing. You're hitting a turning point. Things are changing. Your luck is changing. So I feel like things are moving in the right direction for you. I do feel like, you know, you're becoming more aware of your situation. And, you know, things are going to start becoming more clear. Okay, let's go ahead and get a manifestation moonology card so that we can see what's going on for Pisces. Okay, let your fears dissolve. Full moon in Cancer. So, Spirit is letting you know it's okay to fear, but, you know, let those fears fall away. They're not doing you any good. Okay? 
we have last quarter moon in Sagittarius practice gratitude and we have last quarter moon in Pisces talk less and feel more you always come out very strong in your readings Pisces look at this we have the moon and we have um, this card here you always come out very strong in your readings so I, f I feel like that's you showing up you let spirit letting you know that that yeah this this message is for you okay and we'll get an angel card for Pisces get an angel card for Pisces we have transformation so there's big changes going on right now there's something changing okay we also have forgiveness and understanding so there's a need for you to understand and forgive someone close to you or maybe this is you in need of forgiveness and understanding but i do feel like there is something that you're manifesting you're bringing something to life okay so let's go ahead and get some more oracle cards and then we'll get into your angel number okay we have light activation shine your light your internal guidance is coming through loud and clear use your intuition pisces is the most intuitive of the horoscope so make sure to use your intuition listen to your intuition okay move into your true self rise above the darkness the light is here okay we also have downloads and understanding truth is being revealed deep insights are coming from heaven and the astral realm so yeah i feel like you are really understanding things a little bit more clear there's something shifting within you and around you to where things are changing it's moving you into this position to where you're going to have more clear thinking more clear um, understanding of things and also it's going to free up your mind to fully manifest the things that you want in your life okay so let's get an angel card for Pisces and we have transformation of course okay we have 1919 it is asked that you take notice that you hold within your hands the power to change your life Within this realization, you will feel your sense of purpose and your connection to new beginnings. Okay, Your affirmation, I release what I no longer need to carry and I open myself to the transformative energy of the divine. Okay, okay so that is what I have for you, Pisces. If this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads. Take a look at your sun, moon, and rising uh, to give you more clarity on your situation. If it doesn't resonate, feel free to take a look at your other placements. I have those in the March playlist, so I'll attach that so that you can find them very easily. And until your next reading, Pisces, many blessings to you. Love and light.